Okay, so now we're going to put... I'm putting my glasses on to watch myself, the biggest blockbuster. Koal and 3D, go hit it. Oh, I have to show you right. My fault is yours, right? Yeah. And what I'm going <laughs> <laughs> You guys can't see this the way I can see it, but I am jumping towards me. It's quite fantastic. And what I'm going to... Okay. Yeah, well, it does. And then, ooh, I love it. Thank you very much. Don't think I was having fun just making my own movies and soaking in the chaos. I was also doing what I'm best at, interviewing celebrities. <laughs> Rolling. There is a thing that never seems to leave you, the ghosts of your alleged past link-ups. They never seem to leave you. Does that affect your new face as a Mrs. Bachchan? Does How does it affect it? How do you deal with it? It's, it's, I think that's, I think, your, your, your arena. Or, I mean, with, yeah. with due respect, you know what yeah, I mean? Yeah, because I, you, you, yeah. I look at you as the representative say, right now, but in the context of this question, uh, someone from the media. So I guess you guys will talk and regurgitate whenever necessary or you move forward or sometimes you forecast and you predict. So that's your turf. My area is to live my life and mm. do my job. And that's what I do. And, and if that be in the media spotlight, so be it. Um, but we're all human. We all have a life and we live it. You go with the Notorious. Remember that song? Well, I certainly do. I used to be crazy about Duran Duran. Well, they're still going strong some 30 odd years later. And I have the original band members right here at the Can Pier to talk to me. Nick and John, thank you very much for being on my couch today. Pleasure. It's a very nice couch. Very oh, nice. We like that. Okay, so what brings Duran Duran to Can? That even rhymes, okay? It's a it's bit weird, almost, yeah. It's a um, we're going to play this evening just over there at that place that apparently says Palm Beach, which really I thought that was in America, but, but it's not. It's in Cannes. Um, Everything's in Cannes. Yeah, we're playing at a charity event uh, for, for the Red Charity, so it's very appropriate to have a Red Catch. Um, and, um, and what kind of crowds will you expect tonight? A very, very wealthy one that will give lots of money <laughs> to charity. Right. I think it'll be a real mix. You know, there's a lot of people here, and the the entire film industry descends uh, for for a couple of weeks. So. And do you have do you have uh, some other film actors who are fans of yours? Do you know if they are? Oh, we always say they are, even if they're not. Okay, so let's just say it's so Jude Law, the biggest fan of Jude Duran, 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 right? Okay. Grew up. How different is it playing now than it was when you guys were, you know, in your twenties? Uh, we're probably better now than we ever were before. Uh, we, we've really locked in, we've played a lot more shows, and the excitement and enthusiasm is at a level that I can't even remember it being back then. Really? Is that because you were off your face or because you couldn't? <laughs> <laughs> you know? that oh, you I don't remember. remember. <laughs> yes, well, we are all entirely present all of the time. Yeah, that and now you're more appreciative of it, is it? Yeah, I think that's for sure. Respectful of each other's space and, um, you know, and they, they, like, you know, I don't know, it's just the way that we use our energy that, it, you know, there aren't infinite supplies of energy. So you have to use your energy really wisely to get the job done well. So is it, is it hard aging as a rock star? Yes. Does it get hard to compete with like 16 year olds? We don't compete with 16 You don't, right? Movies, film stars, parties, the red carpet, the dresses, the glitter, the glamour, the sunshine, the wine. Oh, I'm exhausted. That is me and the couch at the 64th Festival de Cannes. And the couch with Coel.